next topic. Uh, linking documents to a report. Um, now there is an ability that you might have some gauge certifications or any type of uh, data documents that you need to link to the system or some summary, Excel summary. So when you send the report out to somebody, they also have the ability to open that document with it or get to the network location and open that document. So there is a link to a document in your network um, that you could e link in Excel, PowerPoint, Word, or any type of email or PDF, HTML, TIFF files or text files um, to, to a template and keep that, uh, uh, keep that embedded with the system. So um, the interface to do that would be, um, let me uh, click on uh, uh, tools, link documents, and I'm going to add a link document um, in Excel, add an Excel document. Um, I'm going to go back to, uh, uh, let's say I want to, uh, you know, I can type in the author name, you can edit all that stuff. Document name is the summary whatever we want to call it, description and type in, and then I can uh, go to the path um, to, let's say, um, 46. So let's say I want an inspection lab report of an Excel file. It could be, a lot of times it's uh, certifications uh, because there is, uh, when you support, submit a uh, report, you also have to say the the humidity, the temperature, and all those measurement parameters, or maybe a gauge r and report, or something along with it. So, just an example to be able to uh, load any type of document and attach it to that, uh, and okay that. So that way, uh, when anybody wants to go, when they open up the template, or when they have the template in the other, uh, this document is attached uh, to it. You could review it by clicking on it, and it would uh, open that report and show it. Um, so now this is a PPAP report for this that was attached um, along with the document. But it could be any type of document, like I mentioned. Okay, I'm going to go back to the PowerPoint. Um, that's the topic number nine about linked documents. 